what just happened to me is an example of what happens when you don't read the whole story. I saw Kevin Durant wanted Steve Nash fired and filmed an entire video. There was there was a bit with a half-eaten bag of Cheetos. I mean, it was a hilarious video. It really was. And, 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 and it's a shame you're never going to see it. But this just went from hilarious to so serious so, so quickly. Oh, my God. Um, I can't make jokes. I, this was, I had such a funny video for y'all, but this, this just got really serious really quickly. So, um, unprofessional. Let me just make sure this is recording. Yes, it is. Okay. Um, Jesus Christ. Kevin Durant in his meeting with Joe Psy says that he not only wants Steve Nash fired, he wants Sean Marks fired too. Oh God, we can't have nice things. Um. Oh God, we can't have nice things. Um. He told Joe Psy, you either pick me or them. When it was just Steve Nash, this was hilarious. This was so friggin' funny. But now, it's Sean Marks too, bro. Oh, Kevin, Kevin. We didn't know what this meeting was gonna be. We didn't know what it would entail, but God, Kevin. I want to like you so bad, bro, but you make it impossible. You and Kyrie make it impossible. You can't force your way. And I mean, not force, it was free agency, but you can't make your way downtown like Vanessa Carlton or whatever her name is and, and come to Brooklyn, force Kenny out of the job, then you, oh, I gotta delete tweets now. Come on, Kevin. You take over the whole organization. You get James Harden. You, 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 you ship off Karis LeVert and Jared Allen. You destroy the entire core of the team. Spencer Dinwiddie's gone. I mean, like, the whole team is gone except for Joe Harris. And now you want Sean Marks gone too? Ah, Kevin! Oh, I can't, I can't side with you on this one. I can't do it. When it's just Steve Nash, I'm right with you. Get Steve Nash out of here. But Sean Marks, come on, bro. That's just... That's so silly. And this is the definition of a knee-jerk reaction. I haven't done much research into this, but it's just like, what does he hope to accomplish? We lost in the first round. A lot of it has to do with Steve Nash. I will, I will, I will give you that. I am king fire Steve Nash. But what does Sean Marks have to do with you being trash like what does that how is that correlating you weren't good enough to win a single game against the celtics and you're blaming sean mark like where's the accountability at bro just do better just play better take it as a personal challenge what does he think is gonna happen here okay you get rid of our general manager then what do we do now what is the next plan of action? You want to own the whole team? You want to be in charge of the whole team on some GM LeBron stuff? Is that what you're after? What is that going to achieve? You can do that after a championship is won or after you make the finals and because of some type of salary thing, you didn't get to what you wanted, but you just want to take over the team just to take over the team? Let me read the report one more time because I... I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not getting it. I'm not getting it. I'm not understanding. Let me just make sure I'm reading this 1000% correctly. Y'all just gonna have to bear with me because the, the math, the math is not mathing here. Okay. 
Don't need the athletic. I just, I, I, I just. In the meeting with Nets owner Joe Sy, Kevin Durant reiterated, I, I believe that's what that word says, reiterated his trade request and informed Sy that Sy, there's, there's a lot of Joe Sy's in here, that's, and reiterated to Sy that Sy needed to choose between Durant or the pairing of general manager Sean Marks and Steve Nash. Oh my God. I, I, I can't. I can't with Kevin. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't with Kevin. How am I supposed to side with that? Because what does that achieve? To what goal? To what means? To what end? Look at what all of what Sean Marks has done. Now, did he drop the ball on multiple occasions? Absolutely. Is it nasty that Kyrie didn't get the max extension? I mean, he's single-handedly one of the reasons why everything went left. So I wouldn't give him a max either. But, you know, it is what it is. But they have done everything for Kevin. And you're rewarded with this hissy fit? And I'm I'm pro player to the max. People, people forget what Sever the Bond is on. I'm pro player to the max. But dog, not this way. Having to choose between having Kevin Durant or getting rid of our entire ownership, well, not ownership, but our general manager and our coach. If this was just he didn't want Steve Nash there, again, the video was hilarious. We was getting to it. The Cheetos bits. The, the, look, and it's empty. The Cheetos bits. I still probably got into my teeth, don't I? <sighs> But Sean Marks too. Why? What, what? What did he? What did he do? What didn't he do to help? I, he got us Ben Simmons for James Harden. I mean, come on, man. We got a Curry out of it and Drummond. I, I just. God. Let me know your thoughts down below because I'm just at a loss for words here. We'll talk about this more tomorrow when the, the, the smoke is cleared some. Do, do, you, do you think we should get rid of Sean Marks and, well, I mean, obviously, yes. Yes, get rid of Steve Nash. But do you think Sean Marks needs to go too so that Kevin Durant can be happy after he just demanded a trade to Phoenix because he doesn't want to make it work here with us? I, I, I just don't. I, God. Oh. Uh... Tomorrow, I'm going to read y'all's comments, and tomorrow we're going to get on here, and we're going to ask the question, Sean Marks or Kevin Durant? And based off of your comments, we're going to have a conversation about it. So just let me know down below what you think. I will read it. Be respectful, because I'm actually reading. And we'll talk about this tomorrow, because I need a day to... God...